When taking the center console out, the first thing that you have to do is get this little piece of carpet out of here. And then remove those two bolts right there. Those are two 10 millimeter bolts. There's the two bolts. Set those to the side. And the center piece just pulls straight up right here. They so pull up on it. There's tabs in the front. Just try to pull them all up at the same time so you don't break any of them. And once that's out, you can just move it around the gear shift. And normally that would just go off to the side, but I have the seat heaters here, and so they're wired up. So just set that over to the side. There's four screws right here that you'll take out. Those four screws, make sure you don't lose them, just set them off to the side. Once the screws are out and the bolts are out of the center console, just lift up on it a little bit. There's just a couple small tabs right there. I just lift it over those, and then it just slides backwards. And then the only two screws that are holding this center piece in were these two right here. To do what we're gonna be doing today, we actually have to pull this piece out as well. Just makes it easier to work on. And that again just pops up. Just use tab, it just has the tabs. Last thing we have to do is pull this little tray out. This just pulls straight out. Again, just tabs, doesn't break anything. And then you can pull the centerpiece out. It's easier to get this centerpiece out if you turn the car on, put it into neutral, and just pull up and out. 